although there was no trading on Friday uh, in New York, the S&P index definitely looks like it wants to continue higher. What's interesting is that uh, this was the end of the quarter, and a quarter that had been just astronomical in gains, and traders still bid the index up. On top of that, we broke the top of a hammer from the Wednesday session, plowing higher on Thursday and essentially stopping, essentially closing at the very highs of the day. With that being the case, this suggests that we will have follow through. And we do think that this area here, this 1550-ish down to 1540 area should be supportive as well. At this point in time, we fully expect to see the S&P climb to the 1600 level mainly because of the liquidity. There's really nowhere else to put your money right now as bonds have just simply stopped offering yield in America as the Federal Reserve continues to drive those yields down by purchases. With that being said, on pullbacks on shorter time frames, we're more than willing to uh, step into the futures market by the SPY, anything along those lines.